What's going on everybody, it's Dr. Scrubbington here, and welcome to another part of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2, Green Stars. This week has uh, been a, a very sad week. We've lost two amazing people who have done just great things for the world, and uh, who have influenced and inspired many other people. We've lost David Bowie and Alan Rickman. Rest in peace to the both of them. I just find it really sad that they were, uh, they were both, uh, 69. They didn't even make it to their 70s, which is, uh, a pretty grand age to live to, a pretty honorable age to get to, you know, especially when you're, uh, popular and you've done so many things in life, you know, it's, uh, very sad. It's also very heartbreaking that they both passed away from, uh, cancer, unfortunately, you know, it's, uh, it's a very bad thing, you know, cancer, it's just uh, one of the worst diseases out there, it's, uh, it's just, and the fact that so much is unknown about it, it's just, it's, it's very, it's very hard, it's very sad. But in the end, you know, w what else can I say, uh, cancer, disease, and death, they're all just parts of life, and, uh, we all just eventually accept that, uh, we go through the, the five stages of grief. And then we come out the other end, and um, we we move on. I guess we don't uh, we don't forget about the we don't forget about them. We never forget about David Bowie or Alan Rickman or anyone anyone who's uh, like died or passed away in the in the last few years. Um, but uh, you know, we just we just uh, accept that you know uh, they they may be gone, but uh, their their work and everything they've done sure as hell isn't. Because I don't mean to be all negative Nancy or anything like that, but. Uh, I honestly feel like cancer probably won't be cured for at least until the last two decades of uh, of this century, at the earliest. Because I mean, look at look at the rate that we're going at. I mean, we've been researching cancer for how long now, and we we haven't come up with much. We really haven't. And uh, to cure death, you know, I know like scientists are trying to figure out how to uh, come up with like more anti-aging things and uh. And just to, to cure death, possibly. Um, but that's probably going to take even longer than it is going to take to cure cancer. So, uh, uh, yeah, it's 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 unfortunate, but it's true. You know, we gotta we lose some people, some pretty great people. Uh, we think about it for a little while, and we remember them. But then, uh, then you know, it just becomes another part of history of the human race. But seriously, guys, donate to cancer research if you can. Seriously, just give a dollar, give two dollars, give, give like ten dollars if you can. Even ten is just, that's, that's great because, you know, just in the future, in those last two decades of this century, uh, who knows, just some young guy or girl is going to be doing some research and something might just click, something might spark, and they could end up discovering the ultimate cure to cancer. And they'd be treated as like a world savior. That person would be so important. The Jews would finally reset their calendar. Okay, okay, I think that's going a little bit too far. Uh, sorry about that last one, but... Uh, yeah, seriously guys. If everyone, if everyone in the United States alone just gave one dollar to cancer research, that's, that's 320 million dollars right there. I mean, just think about what all these scientists and doctors could do with 300 million dollars i mean that's a lot of money and uh what if everyone just gave two dollars that's that's not that much money two dollars it's nothing but that would add up to over 600 million dollars just like think about just think about it like imagine everything that they could do with that money and um if everyone gave ten dollars that's that's not even that much money ten dollars is nothing that's like you know, you buy an Xbox card with that. That's that would add up to over three billion dollars that they could use to uh, get equipment and upgrade and advance and figure out what is causing cancer and how and how we can stop it. Not just cancer, but like other diseases too. Just help the doctors, help the scientists, because you know they're really doing something great for this this uh this this uh this species and i think you should really just appreciate what they do and uh how hard they're actually working on this all right well that was some intro wasn't it let's actually get on to this uh let's get on to this game now today uh we did uh this on the last part the hightail falls galaxy it was an interesting uh it was uh, definitely an interesting 
uh, challenge because it was a, uh, it's it's got to you just got to go fast, mate. But today, after this long and uh, quite depressing week, uh, man, what a way to start out the year, let me tell you. Um, but after all that, I think we should uh, we should cheer up. You know, they may be gone, but their world will keep on spinning. So um, it's it's not the end of the world. Um, let's not forget about them. But let's move on, if you know what I mean, if you if you get what I'm saying. Let's play the Boulder Bowl Galaxy today, and let's get three green stars. Um, there's three in this galaxy. The first one is uh, very, very easy. It's like right here at the beginning. It's uh, uh, I, don't, I don't know if you'd be able to figure it out if you, uh, if you didn't look it up, because I don't know if you can see it. They'll probably show it, and you could probably see all the green stars, like from the... Or not, I was going to say you could probably see them all from the from the beginning shot here but they they show this because this is like the new power up in this stage but i believe it's right above that it's like right above there um so we're not actually going to uh kill these guys we're not going to worry about that the first green star is simply right over here now what do you what do we do with this you may ask well if it isn't easy, if it isn't obvious enough um hold on just a second that, that was a fail okay um you just do this. You just wall jump up the top of them. You can you can wall jump, even though they're just like girders uh, and like steel beams. You can Jeff Fuel Cam and still be okay. I'm sorry. Um, uh, yeah, you can do this. Uh, we gotta spin jump and do that. Um, he's like hitting the the wall behind there. So let's see. How do we how do we get this? Um, you have to just come up here and grab it. Okay, I don't I don't know how to get this. This is whoa there. I believe that's oh 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 no i screwed it up what the hell why is this so challenging jesus christ uh uh i, I can't i can't do it man it's too much for me to handle oh that's pretty good there we go okay that, that was that was cool okay so that's how you get the first green star it's just right up there i thought that would be a lot easier than it was at the end right there okay okay and yeah what do you know the video's lagging um I've talked about this uh, before on the last part, I think, right? Yeah, I've got to get the newer Elgato Man, or at least just a, a newer capture card in general, because uh, this this regular Elgato, I don't I don't know, man. I guess it's just uh, I guess it's just outdated, and it's uh, I really don't know what's causing it to like drop frames like this. I'm I'm still confused as to if it's really the 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 capture card itself or the the uh, or the software, because. Uh, uh, you know, uh, the internet's not really the biggest help when it comes to actually figuring out the solutions to things. Either you're going to get really shitty tutorials on YouTube, or you're just not going to find any answer at all. And you don't feel like asking a question because you don't think anyone's going to uh, have the same exact problem as you anyway. And chances are that's it. No one ever has the exact same problem as you. And then it just becomes a, a really big mess and you start to stress out and you start contemplating your life. Okay, perhaps it's a little too deep. Um, but yeah, long story short, I've got to upgrade again. This is like the fifth time I'm upgrading on my channel. But anyways, um, let me take a look at how to get the second green star right now. Okay, so this one is kind of like the first one, but uh, it may be a little bit trickier because I'm not sure how good the camera is going to be on this one. The camera is going to be your best friend in this mission. So let's see. Uh, let's choose that green star too and... Let's do this. Let's try not to die at all. I just realized that the thing there that the mushrooms on it's just, it's just a poker chip It's just a giant poker chip. Okay, so this time we actually have to get the the, the rock power up So let's go ahead and kill these guys right here and uh, let's get that triple. Oh watch this 360. Oh, oh <laughs> Look at that look at that freaking trick shot man. This is too dang for me mate. Yo, um, let's let's grab this friggin uh the weed, the kill streak. We got the kill streak, yo. Okay, no more Call of Duty jokes. I I used up all my Call of Duty jokes. I know I make way too many Call of Duty jokes, and that's just because I'm a Call of Duty player. Um, just like any other 14-year-old scrub lord, I I play Call of Duty and first-person shooter games because I'm a friggin' faggot. But I've realized that uh those Call of Duty jokes are getting pretty old by now. So um. Uh, in order to keep my videos fresh, I'll only say like three Call of Duty jokes in a video, and I'll probably say them together. I won't. I'll, I'll just try to say a lot less Call of Duty jokes. So set a, a limit to how many I can say, 
And if I say them, well, that's it. I can't make any more Call of Duty jokes. And if I do, well, then screw me, because it's just... I should just go kill myself now. Okay, so anyways, I'm not going to be making as many uh, Call of Duty jokes or, like, MLG jokes and stuff like that, because uh, uh, that's not cool if I just keep using those stupid-ass jokes, you know. Uh, that's that's really gonna hurt this channel and it's it's not gonna let it go anywhere like like this is ever gonna go anywhere anyways but uh, uh you know what I'm getting at so uh, uh with this star you don't wanna I know I know it's tempting but you don't wanna you don't wanna use the uh, the the rock power here you don't want to uh, go up this ramp you can't uh, I know I know I really want to get a strike man but uh, it's just no you can't what you have to do is actually just forget about the rock and you see right there that's where it is it's right up this ramp so I think if we just line this up correctly and then just fall I mean oh crap Jesus thanks Vunderhar wait never mind that's a that's a Call of Duty joke whoops I already broke the rule up according to the North Korean Constitution I should be killed now anyways let's give this another go uh, I'm sure I'm sure that was just uh you know everyone makes mistakes that was just a silly mistake let's Let's try this again, you know, um, everybody makes mistakes, we're only just humans, let's, okay, um, first one didn't count, let's go. I'm beginning to realize I should probably wall jump right there, mm, yep, that'd probably be a, that would probably be a much better idea! Well, uh, third time's the charm, isn't it, uh, okay, let's see, let's, let's jump and, um, yeah, just, just, uh, kill me now. Can we just turn the camera like that, we, we can turn the camera. I forgot about the D-pad. I'm, I'm such a noob. Ugh, I just forgot about the D-pad, and I, I just, I, I shook the Wii remote. Um, I meant to act, but it just, yep. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I should, I thought, I should have thought twice about that. Um, th this isn't going too well, is it? Okay, let's be really careful here. Let's turn the camera. Now let's jump. Okay, let's jump. And, uh, nope, nope, that wasn't gonna work. Why is this so freaking hard? What is this? What is- Do you see this is happening? I feel so much like Ego Raptor right now. Like, seriously, no offense to him, but this is honestly the kind of crap that happens to him. Uh, where just- I mean, I'm sorry if I'm making myself look like a fool, but I'm pretty sure I'm making myself look like a fool, because, uh... I don't think that was supposed to happen. Seriously though, why, why is this so difficult? It's because you can't spin jump. That's why. It's because you can't spin jump. And to do something like that, you would normally need to spin jump. But you can't do like this thing. Alright, alright, let's see. I bet you if I just jump like that. There we go. There we go. There we go. Why was that so hard? Why was that so hard all this time? I don't know. But anyways, there we go. We got the, the second green star. Okay. Just one more left. Let's see how um, painstakingly difficult this one's gonna be. Okay, so they don't really say that much about this one. They just kind of say it's uh, uh, just walk up to a ledge and it will be on the the second planet. So uh, we do, we kind of gotta look around for this one and uh, and figure it out. But just like the second one, it requires us to commit suicide almost. So um, yeah, yeah, uh, be prepared for that. For me to. Uh, kill myself accidentally three times. So this time we're allowed to kill these guys. Let's see. Let's just let's freaking cheat. Yeah, look at that strike, man. We just uh, we totally didn't cheat at all. It's not like we went to the end of the the alley and did no no. It's, it's just uh, you didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. All right. Well, let's come over here and it's it's uh it's over here on this planet. So let's see if I can uh, scout this thing out. Let's let's try to find this. Let's go on a killing spree first and get a a kill streak or not or I can just yep. Okay, well, let's see. Don't want to kill too many of, uh, okay, I just lost the power-up. That's fine. Uh, that will actually help. Um, now that I think about that, that actually probably helps because, uh, uh, now I can spin jump if I have to. Let's, let's take cover behind this thing and, uh, let's see, where is it? Uh, I'm gonna have to go around the, the edge right here. I feel like I'm in the friggin' military right now, just, like, going around enemy lines and, okay, let's see. They, they see me, though. They can see me. I'm not a, I'm not a very good... Uh, solid snake ninja and friggin thing um, Luigi you should you should work on that um, but let's see uh, I don't want to kill myself by changing the camera too much here but uh, there it is I see the glow it's actually at the very edge of the planet uh, let's just uh, kill this guy right here get a coin from him I uh, cornered you uh, why, why did I let this happen to me oh my god I'm I'm so much like Ego Raptor and Aaron Hansen right oh Jesus Christ 
kill me now. Just aliens, come take me off of this planet. I can't, I can't do this anymore, man. It's, it's too much for me to handle, bro. I'm gonna have to start over. I'm gonna have to reset myself and, uh, get a new name and change my life up. Why do I, why am I so bad at this right now? It's because two of the best people in the world just died this week, and it's too much for Luigi to handle. Anyways, this one seems fairly easy. There we go. Um, at least I didn't, um, die more than once on that, I guess, if, uh, if, if that makes you feel any better, uh, but let's see, that, that was the last one, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, that was the last green star, okay, so we did it, we got the, the Boulder Bowl Galaxy, I don't know why these green stars require you to almost commit suicide, and, uh, you will accidentally do it if you're not careful enough, like, I don't see why they couldn't make it have to do with the rock power up more, because that was the whole gist of the, the galaxy. And I know, you know, the green stars aren't really supposed to be like regular missions. They're supposed to be just kind of crazy, wacko, hidden things that you're not really supposed to look up at all. And it's supposed to take you like 5 billion years to find them all. But hey, the internet exists and so do walkthroughs. And that's not my fault. So, oh well, I guess. You know, actually trying hard to find things in video games is, uh... Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's too much work, man. I'd rather go to McDonald's. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this week's episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2 Green Stars. If you did, then definitely be sure to uh, hit that like button down below if you want to see more. Uh, let's try to get 15 likes on this video. How about it, guys? And uh, also, uh, share this video with your friends. Uh, if they need help or something like that on how to not commit suicide, um, that, that, that wasn't funny. And if you haven't already, then be sure to click that subscribe button down below if you don't want to miss out on more Super Mario Galaxy 2 and other videos like this in the future. I know it's been a, a very, very emotional week this week, and, uh, it's always hard when, uh, some of the... The great actors and singers and artists when they pass away. But like I said earlier, uh, unfortunately, it's just a part of life. So, uh, yeah. Rest in peace, David Bowie and Alan Rickman. You two were amazing. You did some very great things for this world. And, uh, yeah. Rest well, you two. We'll never forget you. Anyways, guys, tomorrow I'll be returning to Sonic World. I'll be back with uh, a fan-made stage or two. But as for this video, guys, uh, I hope you, uh, I hope you at least enjoyed your week, even though uh, we lost some pretty good people. Um, I hope you had a good week anyway, and I hope you enjoy your weekend. And uh, um, let's let's enjoy the rest of January. So uh, yeah, that's all for this video, guys. Um, I will see you guys all on another video. So. Yeah, have a good day, everybody. Peace.